Right, so here is a video we are going to find the NCL situation here. So we know that the Pascal triangle, so, all right, this is how we represent NCL. Some of the book calls write it like this, or some of the books write it like this. They are all the same. Uh, we don't always see this. All right, so this means the exponential of those. So in another words, we can have the formula of it. So L factorial and N minus R factorial. So in this video, we are going to show you how to do, how to find the key on the factorial of the screen uh, on the GDC or N actually exactly to find the NCL there. So we are going to find the factorial and the NCR. So what we're going to do is um, I'm going to show you the logging there so that whenever we type, you can see it on the side. So we have going to one here, our normal function here. Our normal function here, that is the, right, so we have one, and then we get to the choice there, and then let's run you through. Um, to do the NCR, for example, let's have an example there. And um, if I want to type four, if I want to find four factorial by hand, we can do it like this. Right, I'm sorry. Yeah, that happens. I'm a bit nervous here. And you can do a lot of multiplication. You can do the one, one times two times three times four. That give us the factorial answer, no, no doubt, no, no problem with that. And However, what we're going to do is that we're not the factorial. So we have four, the factorial hide inside the option. So four option. And then we have, we look for probability, not here, next page. And here is the probability. And here's the factorial, look at that. So, and then EXC, you got the answer there. All right, you got the 24 there. I'm going to the next line so that you can see that what we are doing with those. All right, so this is factorial. And if you if we want to find that's 24 by GDC. All right, all you can do is you can do you can get it by with a factorial. So it's 5C3. All right, 5C3. So you can use the factorial formula. All right, so we can do the fraction there. Uh, on the top is five. Factorial, oh, I lost it. So we have five factorial. And then underneath, you can have three factorial times two factorial. That gives us the answer of 10. Okay, or actually, we can actually type the NCR. So we have 5C2 there should give us the same answer. Yes, that's we go. All right, this is how we got through those with the answer and so. And last but not least, I want to share with you is the whole list of NCR. So we know that uh, the Pascal triangle is one. So I learned that because I, I learned it when I was young. Uh, yeah, I got good teachers. So no, 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 my teacher are great, not just good. But then um, I like to do those maths and I can actually get that in my mind there. All right, you can have those or you can go to my IG account. You got you just got a new video on those. Anyway, so this is the Pascal triangle. What if? I am not, uh, uh, I suddenly do not want to do all those from the scratch and I just want this row. So our GDC, our Casio actually does help us with those. So what you need to do is that you go to this time, uh, okay, next page, uh, we go to manual and then this time we need to go to stats. It's a bit weird, but then yeah, stats help us with those. So what we're going to do is in list one, we're going to type in the, because we got we want the fifth row right so for the fifth row the ncr will be counting from from zero one two three four five this is the counting right so what we're going to do is actually i will have to type in 
zero, one, two, three, four, five here to tell the calculator that is the point there. So I'm typing here this person. So zero, one, two, three, four, five. All right, that tell, just tells us which terms we are using from, from the zeros term to the first, second, third, and the fifth. All right, next bit, there is a trick here. We go to the top here, we go to the list. We go to list there. Okay, but then this time we are going to type things while the list two is highlighted because that's what we want. So we want five, uh, we want NCR, right? So we have five C, which is we learn how to find it, uh, probability C, and the R to be any value here. So what we're going to do is we go to look for the list, which is here on the comment. So this is under the list subtitle. And then we go for list here. Which list? List one, this value here. So once you do that, you press enter and magic's happen. Now here is all the value from, from the zeros term go down first, fifth, 10, and so on. So from now on, if you need a particular row on a Pascal triangle, you do not need to work it out through the top. You can do it straight. I hope you like this video because in this one, we have gone through a few things. We have used the calculator to, part, to calculate the value of NCR factorial and the whole list, a whole row of the Pascal triangle. Hope you like the video. Thank you.